that day when he, the bus driver asked me to get up, I had this feeling come over me. Here are 20 black Americans that changed the world forever. Claudette Colvin was just 15 years old when she refused to move to the back of a bus in Montgomery, Alabama. She stood up for her rights eight months before Rosa Parks famously did the same. She remains a civil rights activist to this day. Benjamin O'Davis Sr. served in the U.S. military for 50 years and became the nation's first black general. Jesse Owens was a world-class athlete who set an Olympic record for the long jump in 1936, which he held for 25 years. He also brought the U.S. four gold medals during the 1936 Summer Olympics in Berlin, Germany. Shirley Chisholm was the first black woman to be elected to Congress. In 1973, she became the first woman to run for the Democratic Party's presidential nomination after which she famously returned all of her donations. Alice Allison Dunnigan was the first black female to serve as a White House correspondent. During the Kennedy administration, she worked as an education consultant on the President's Committee on Equal Employment Opportunity. Gordon Parks was the first black staff member at Life magazine, which helped launch his career in photography and film. A self-taught photographer, his photos were featured in publications like Vogue, and he went on to become the first black director of a major film, Shaft. Amelia Boynton Robinson was among the first black women to register to vote in Selma, Alabama. One year later, she became the first black woman to run for Congress in the state. Kimberly Bryant, an electrical engineer with an impressive career history, founded Black Girls Code to bring the younger generations into science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. Daisy Bates was a fierce civil rights activist who became an advocate for the Little Rock Nine, a group of black students who attended an all-white school during Arkansas's early desegregation efforts. Jane Bolin was the first black woman to attend Yale Law School and subsequently became the first black female judge in the U.S. George Washington Carver was an agricultural scientist and inventor. He founded a school to introduce farmers to new techniques and advancements, revolutionizing the farming industry. His influence can be found all over the world. Tarana Burke is the founder of the Me Too movement. It has empowered survivors of abuse to speak out about their experiences all over the world. Mary Ellen Pleasant was an entrepreneur in the 1800s when the slave trade was still active. She, along with her husband, funded abolitionist organizations that helped black Americans flee north to escape slavery in the south. Ruby Bridges was the first black student to attend William Franz Elementary School in Louisiana, which triggered desegregation efforts across the south. She was only six years old when she walked into the school, escorted by federal marshals for protection. Today, she is 66 years old and remains a vibrant activist and speaker. Matthew Alexander Henson teamed up with Robert Peary on an expedition to find the North Pole. After eight failed attempts to reach the landmark, the pair finally reached their destination in 1909 and became the first people ever to set foot there. Henrietta Lacks didn't know it at the time, but her cervical cancer diagnosis would help medical research for decades after her passing. In fact, her cell samples played a huge role in the research and development of the polio vaccine. Hers is the first immortalized human cell line and one of the most important in medical research. Mae Jemison rode the Space Shuttle Endeavour to become the first black woman to orbit in space. Since then, she has worked to promote multiple programs in science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. Edward Boucher graduated sixth in his class at Yale University and became the first black person to earn a PhD in the US. He was also the sixth person ever to earn a PhD in physics. Rosemarie McCoy took on the white male dominated pop music industry in the 1950s, where she wrote and produced songs for artists like Elvis Presley and Big Joe Turner. Dr. Rebecca Lee Crumpler was the first black female physician in the US. She served as a nurse for several years before pursuing and earning her MD in 1864. For more videos like this, subscribe and sign up for Morning Smile.